I'm Pam from the Southern Living Test Kitchen, and today we're having a crawfish boil. This is just salt, and this cleanses them of any impurities and dirt. And then I'll just cover them with water and stir them real good for about three minutes. And then I'll rinse it off and rinse them two or three times until you start seeing your water run clear. And they're just gonna rest here for a little while while I get my water boiling and get my spices ready to season the water. Okay, we're gonna cook our crawfish in a, a large turkey fryer. Um, and I'm gonna fill this up just a little more than halfway full with water and bring this to a rolling boil. And we're gonna add the lemons that we've already cut up and the jalapenos the 16 ounce package of the crab boil and we're going to use a half of a 12 ounce bottle of hot sauce, three 12 ounce bottles of beer. I added my seasonings and the lemons and the jalapenos directly to the water and not in the basket because I'll leave them in the water the entire time while the vegetables are cooking and also while the crawfish are cooking. And then I'm going to cover it, reduce the heat, and simmer it for 15 minutes. Now we're going to add our potatoes, the onions, the garlic cloves, and our sausage. And that's going to go down into our simmering water. And this is going to simmer covered for 25 minutes. I'm going to add my corn and my mushrooms. I give it a little stir and we're gonna simmer it for about eight minutes. The vegetables are in there with all the crab oil and the jalapenos and the onions, so they're, you know, they're soaking up all that wonderful flavor too. Now we're gonna remove our vegetables and get ready to cook our crawfish. That's 40 pounds, about four batches, because you cook about 10 pounds at a time. Once your water comes back to a boil after you've dropped your crawfish down in there, I'm gonna set my timer and let them boil for five minutes. Then I'll turn my heat off and cover my pan and let them sit for about 15 minutes. They continue to cook in this hot water, so you don't wanna boil them too long because you'll end up making them tough. Okay, we're gonna drain these good like we did our others. I'm going to season them heavily with the Cajun seasoning and then we're going to call a tasting and see what people think. This is our traditional crawfish boil where you've got the potatoes, the sausage, the corn. It's seasoned up nice and spicy and now they're ready to eat. <laughs> and after all your hard work, this makes it worth it. Yum. <laughs>